Hello, everybody, and thank you for joining us back here at First Tellurium's channel. We're sitting here once again with President and Chief Executive Officer Ty. And Ty, you're here to deliver some good news today. Give us the 411. So, yeah, we put out a news release today talking about the, an airborne survey that we found that was done in 2012, saying that we had up to eight potential core free, uh, core free copper targets and, and SCARNs. And it sort of goes along with our 2018 report that mentioned we had multiple uh, opportunities of having copper porphyries, although that report itself is dedicated to the gold, silver, tellurium uh, area that we have. And what makes it interesting is that uh, in the new world green metal situation, copper is still the most important mineral. And even though it hasn't been our focus up to now, we realize that we may be sitting on something very, very uh, impressive to say the least. So our attention is sort of focused that way to let people know that we're more than a one trick pony. Yeah, yeah. I mean, fair enough. Right now, while we, we don't even have a plan in place to meet the copper demand we're looking at with the EV revolution, we are trying to push through here. So copper is a definitely a very lucrative base metal right now to get into. So Ty, thank you for the insight and thank you for the update. If anybody has any questions, please don't be afraid to send them over to us. For now, Ty, any closing words before we go? No, just excited to keep exploring that property and see what other minerals we have that uh, we weren't expecting to find. We know there's some there like tungsten and all that. So, uh, you know, so as we go along progressing, well, I'm sure we'll come across many new interesting things. Because as I said before, it's a phenomenal property and we're very lucky to have it. Perfect. And as we find more, we will keep you guys updated. So stay tuned. Thank you for your time today, Ty, and have a wonderful day. Thank you, Michael.